What makes the plants strong and stand erect amidst all the environmental conditions? It is because of plant cells. The rigidity of the plant cell is due to the presence of a special layer external to the cell membrane, called the cell wall, which is absent in animal cells. Let us quickly go through the key points of the cell wall. The cell wall is a non-living, rigid, protective layer present external to the cell membrane. The cell wall is present not only in plant cells, but also in cells of bacteria, algae, fungi, and protists. Talking about the composition of the cell wall in plants, it is composed of chemicals like cellulose, hemicellulose, and pectin. Do you think the cell wall of plant cells is a single layer? Structurally, the plant cell wall may have three layers, namely, the primary cell wall, the secondary cell wall, and the tertiary cell wall that is present only in some plant cells. The primary cell wall is thin and elastic and made up of cellulose, hemicellulose, pectic substances, lipids, and proteins. The secondary cell wall, if present, is made up of cellulose, hemicellulose, and lignin predominantly, and provides mechanical support to the plant. The tertiary cell wall, if present, is very thin, made up of xylin, and provides density to the cell. In addition to different cell walls, the primary cell walls of adjacent cells are cemented by a special layer, called middle lamella, composed of calcium and magnesium pectates. Do you think the composition of cell walls in other organisms would be the same as in plant cells? Considering algae, the cell wall is made up of chemicals like cellulose, pectin, algin, and polysulfate esters. Talking about the cell wall in a bacterial cell, it is made up of peptidoglycan, which is an alternating polymer of the chemicals. NAG representing N-acetylglucosamine and NAM representing N-acetylmuramic acid. Next, in fungi, the cell wall is made up of chitin, which is a polymer of NAG. Talking about protists, organisms like diatoms have silica as a major component in their cell wall. Do you know that the siliceous cell wall of diatoms makes them economically important after their death? The material is called diatomaceous earth. Functionally, the cell wall provides structural integrity to the cell. It protects the internal structures from mechanical stress. These are the structural and functional details of the cell wall.